Hey guys, we're going to be doing a build showcase on what I think might be a good version for the Enchant Sword. And we're going to be using the Zeal Helm in order to use it all. So let's pop in with our gear real quick. And I'll show you guys all the stats and all that stuff as well. So let's start with our skills. We're starting with maxing out Warmth, maxing out Fire Enchant, maxing out Fire Mastery, and whatever else we need in order to get it. One point all down here, static field, all the way down to energy shield. And here I went cold enchant, all the way down to chilling armor. And I did one point in the cold mastery as well. We could probably max this out, but for this build um, and this showcase, I'm gonna leave those, the rest of those options up to you guys. Just gonna show you guys how it actually works with this level right now. So the gear that we are going to be using is for killing, we're going to be using a Hand of Justice. Gives you the negative 20 fire resist. Using Ferocity. This is the Zeal Helm, cannot be frozen. Rising Sun, plus two fire skills, fire absorb, negative fire resist. Also adds a lot of fire damage as well. We're using Phoenix. Negative fire resist redemption helps a lot. And the fire absorb. Natalia's soul. Stone of Jordan. Stone of Jordan. Nasferitus. This is for the IAS. This mixed with this will give us our last breakpoint. We're using Hellmouth as well. Fire damage, negative fire resist, fire absorb. And we also have a dragon. Gives us a holy fire, plus strength. Increases our max res a lot. So that's what we're going to be using on a kill basis. When we are entering a map or anything, we're going to be using revives as well. So eternity, this gives us plus four to revive. And we can now summon six additional revives as well for a total of nine. And we're using a lidless on swap just to help cast those. You can switch back to your weapon once. But once you switch back, you lose your revive, so keep that in mind. We have a Annie, a Torch, and we just have some Resist Charms just to round out the rest of the build here. So, when you're using this, you have the Snapshot. So, I'll show you guys the Snapshot in a second. So, your Snapshot, we're using an Aki, just for the plus three all skills. Shaco, plus two all skills. Using Amaras, plus two all skills. Lidless, Nats again. SOJ, SOJ, Iraq, for plus one all skills. Mage Fists, for the plus one fire skills. And also K Hagen's for the plus two all skills as well. Then we're gonna swap out all of our charms. Casting all of our buffs. That gives us, just so you guys see, level 47 fire enchant. Adds a lot of damage here, guys. A lot of damage. So let's swap back. We have 83 fire resist, 83 lightning resist, a lot of resists here. So we're completely maxed, and our damage that we're doing with Zeal is 8,700 per swing. We have enough strength to wear all of our gear, enough dex to wear our phase blade. You can probably use a different weapon, but this is not indestructible, so this is why I went with the phase blade. And then I went a balance between energy and vitality. We only have 700 life, but we have 700 mana as well. And that gives us a spread of what we're looking to do and maintain. Merc, using Infinity, this is Endgame, Infinity, Mancatcher, Ferocity, for the Taunt, Fortitude, Gore Rider, Nosferatus, and Dracul's. He's almost maxed, so we're looking good. And mind you, this is level 84, and I have 20 points left over. Lots of options with this so far. So let's hop into a cow level map, just to show you guys what we're dealing with here.
This cat this kills really really quickly here. And let's get our revives up. And we go back and we start clapping with our revives up as well. Revives actually don't stay up. So you'd have to choose between Eternity or Hand of Justice here. Both work. So let's go back and swap something out real quick. So we want to hit our max breakpoint, so I'm going to go back to High Lords here. So this will hit our max break point with Eternity. Doing a lot of damage, you're pretty tanky here too. You have the mobility of teleport. a meme build guys but it works pretty well so that is the sorcerer's build showcase not too bad probably could be tweaked a lot here guys um i kind of just threw this together based off of feedback that i've seen let me know what you guys want to see differently if there's anything that would be better off on this character maybe dragon's not the best um, let me know drop it down in the comments and i can always redo it based off of the community feedback thanks for checking it out and as always let me know if you guys want to see any other builds i'll do my best to use my beta access to keep giving you guys as much as i possibly can Check you guys next time. Make sure you guys like and subscribe for future videos as well. Thanks for being here.